Which one are you gonna get? So I'm gonna get the blood drain, so I'm gonna get banana, strawberries, and then peanut um, almond butter. Welcome back to a, another vlog. Today we have our made our first stop and the first part of the vlog is going to be food which I know you guys love. Um, we made our first stop at Box Park Shoreditch because I have been craving an acai bowl for ages. So we went to acai berry, got my acai bowl and then on the way we saw this like Mexican stand like food stand and it just looks so good so we had to get some nachos say Mexican standoff like no Mexican stand so we had to get some nachos and some chicken quesadillas mm. this was meant to be a healthy acai bowl sort of intro but couldn't resist mm. okay what's the plan today tell them the plan you tell them so today we were planning to go to an outlet uh, called Bista Village. So Bista Village has like um, different designers um, outlets there. You can actually find some pretty decent pieces there. Yeah, but last time we, the last two times we've been, we haven't bought anything. But we go there just for the the Ooh. noodles. Mm. There's like a little stand that has that sells these Chinese noodles, which we absolutely love. These not, and I really like the sauce on these nachos. So they gave nachos on this one, so. This could have been our nachos. Yeah, but it's not the same. Yeah, so we're basically going to Bista Village today because it's such a rainy, gloomy day in London, as usual. Um, so I thought, let's just go to Bista Village and see what they have. How do you eat this? Um, no, he made it really messily. Okay. But then also, what does he do with the other two? I think he throws it away. That's really sad. So we got a regular. Uh, so that's just like half of a whole tortilla. So basically we went to the acai place um, and we queued up for like this We queued up for Box Park, the main yep. Box Park bit um, because we didn't realise the acai berry place was actually underneath so we didn't have to queue up so we like downloaded the app, got our temperature checked, walked in and then the, la the lady told us that I was downstairs which is actually even better because there's no queue, just go straight in I, re I actually wanted to go to Juice Baby originally, the one in Notting Hill but it's not on the way to this village Okay so I feel like the nachos I give it like a seven because it's cold and it's like um it's not much to it. Yeah, I thought there would be cheese on it. Ah. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna get some water from Sainsbury's and then make our journey to Vista Village which, which is actually around like an hour long drive, isn't it? From here is an hour. Oh, acai bowl. You don't eat that. Oh we have to have an acai bowl. <laughs> we're not done yet. We're not done yet. I was ready to wrap it up. I have the small acai bowl with berries. So like strawberries, banana and peanut butter. I always need peanut butter. This is what we came here for and then we ended up getting Mexican. <laughs> acai berries, if you don't know, are very beneficial for you. They gave me this leaflet which has 10 benefits of acai. Heart health, resistant to harmful organisms, supporting weight loss, promote skin health, digestion, irritation, improve cellular health, immune booster, anti-aging effects, energy boost and many more. I mean, I get it just for the taste of it, but the fact that it is good for you is a bonus. I've tried making them myself before, but they're never the same. I really like, I love Juice Baby in Notting Hill. I haven't had this in ages, this brand. But I think the best acai bowls I've had were in America, isn't it? Mm. American ones are just different. They just hit different in LA. LA is like acai bowl. That's probably some Justin Bieber. Yeah, we were just eating our acai and then Justin Bieber came along and was handing out like leaflets or something. 
there's a video on YouTube of True, you can actually see mainly True and a little bit of me walking behind Justin Bieber because obviously TMZ were recording him and we were like following him <laughs> we just want to see where he was going and then um, you can see us behind him there's a lot of people walking by watching us eat mm. but this is training for when we go on holiday we need to be prepared to eat and record one holiday though is different because mm. um, mm. when you're on holiday mm. it's nice isn't it I have a feeling this village is going to be pretty not really because it's raining. Yeah, but people like us were like, oh, it's raining, let's go to fish. Because if it wasn't raining, I actually don't know, what do people think? Because I feel like if it wasn't raining, they'd rather go to the park or like somewhere nice. For those of you who's wondering, this fit, this <laughs> t shirt, is from a, a vintage store in LA. Jackets from Prada from the previous vlog. Want one more? No. Oh, super. Wait, the so yeah, it's raining a lot and we don't have an umbrella. Wait, I might do. Oh my god, it's actually raining a lot. And we just drove two hours. It's fine. What's the weather like? Cool, it's gonna rain till seven. Yeah, so we're just waiting. <laughs> no. Uh, no, no, no. One sec, I'm, I reckon I do have an umbrella. Oh, it's windy and rainy. She's just done a home vlog. Yeah, we should have just done a home vlog. I don't need to think about it. There's nothing in this world that we can't do. Flowers even mad about it. Cause they can't blow like you don't. I don't see a way around it. Cause everything has led me straight to you. It's nothing new. Baby, I'm outside. Been thinking about you all night. Been thinking it ain't right if you and me. Only see us in our dreams, I'm outside Be thinking that you're all night Okay, so I like these ones, I think they're really nice How much are they? They're half price, so they're... Oh. Yeah, so I'm 4 5 Yeah, I'm gonna have to They look like even with this outfit Very cool Fendi skirt How much is this one? Mm. £225. Oh, I've actually been looking for a Fendi swimsuit. Is it reverse? Oh, like it is, no, it's yeah. not. It's not oh, no, it's not. But I wouldn't that print. £210. Oh. Max Mara. What are we looking for here, darling? Darling? <laughs> um, just anything. Like, this is quite nice, like a short coat, isn't it? How much is this? One thousand two hundred. It's not for summer. It's for like next year. Look at all the colours. I love that. So nicely sorted. The aesthetics. Dreams. I'm outside. I like these. I really like them actually. They're two nine seven fifty. Let's see if they have a size 39. I really like them. But I think I'll get more wear off the white. Size 39. Ooh, I love these colours. How much? It's what, 26775? And this one I like as well. This is 155. It's like a... What size are they? I really like these two. I might get them. They're really. Also, like, this is like. Forever. Do you know what I mean? What about the blazer behind that? Blazer? Mm, no, I'm not basic, yeah. Let's see. They look like a snout. Let's see. Love these. See the full outfit? Jump up on 
I just feel like it's like a basic blue jumper. I do really like the colour, but I don't think it's worth three hundred pounds. Uh, wait, untuck it. So this is what it looks like from top. This is, it's such a nerdy bag, isn't it? <laughs> look, Wait, look, look in mini. the mirror. Little, taking mini bags to the next level. What can you put in there? My car keys. Did a bad thing. No, it's not a bad thing, it's a good thing. Okay, did a good thing. <laughs> this is so cute. Why? I'm not happy. They got rid of the bubble seed place. And, and the, the noodle, noodle place. place. The like, yeah. What's the point of coming here? Literally, I one thing that makes me want to come here, oh, I'm dribbling. <laughs> the one thing that makes me want to come here is that noodle place. Like I'm addicted to it and they got rid of it. I think it's, it's like the best food International noodles. travel is not like permitted anymore, so there's no point of catering to an audience that's not there. So we have to get fit go for it too, didn't we? Yeah, even that was empty. But True yeah, said that because international travels closed, all the Chinese people are not coming anymore. So now yeah. all the Chinese food stores are shutting down, which is very sad because they're the best. But positive note. We've got a Fendi <laughs> umbrella bag. Yeah. I think that's very chic of Fendi to manufacture their own um, little umbrella bag. Bougie. Um, yeah, it was quite busy today. You had to queue up for a lot of the places. So like, we didn't really start and also I'm on my first day of my period which is very painful I can't I can't do much so now we're gonna go I'm gonna get through to pop into like a shop to get me some ibuprofen because I'm in a bit of pain and um, so we had to cut the shopping short didn't do as much shopping as we thought we would but also surprised by the fact that I actually bought something because normally we don't really buy much when we come here we come to browse and like eat food really isn't it <laughs> yeah. um, it's, so, like, it's like a two hour one hour and a half one hour and 40 minute drive yeah but we came for the noodles and it's Yeah, that fun. was one of the main things that made us come here. That was very disappointing. So we probably won't be coming here for a long time. Yeah. But I, I'm I am not coming here again. Oh. What's the point? But I like my shoes that I got. I'm really happy with those. Half price, Bottega shoes. And they're like a classic pair of slingbacks. I love them. Oh, I've got my Babbily ate though. I've got myself a cappuccino with oat milk for the journey home. Uh, and you also got kombucha and I got mochi, chocolate oh, we might mochi. As well, we might as well eat now as well. Oh yeah, okay. And we got some... Uh, I'm really surprised that I found kombucha in Ipsu. Why? I would think I though. feel like kombucha is like a hip... hip you need to drink thing. it now though before it gets... Um, you got a lot of drinks actually. Because yeah. kombucha oh, warm oh, is not nice. People are coming to sit next to us. Oh really? Mm. How do you know it's so cold? How do you know it's so cold? I saw the light flash. Oh, oh god. <laughs> I like it. Mm. That's nice. Give me a bit more. Here. Okay, Mula, are you going to eat some rice? Yeah. We got some uh, like vegan rice thing. Yeah. There's a lot of vegan options. And then we've got Cheese. Little Moon's mochi. But Chocolate not, and mango. Not the frozen ones. Yeah, but I actually love these just as much as the frozen ones. Yeah, so this is like Chocolate wine. Mm. Oh, I didn't realize this is Itsu's. Oh, wait, it says Itsu and then it says Little Moon, so it's a collaboration. Oh, not too bad. Can I have bad. a fork, please? I can't eat. Do you want a spoon? Yeah. For my non Asian. No, I can eat with chopsticks, but I'm just not in the mood to play around with food at the moment. That's like saying, that's like saying, I'm not going to eat with my hands because I'm not feeling it my playing with my food. Like, you know, it's it, easier. It. Okay. Okay. You're right. She found another spot. Nope, she's parking. Okay, let's go. Bye. <laughs> okay, they've gone now. We get a little bit shy, don't we, True? Yeah. Especially post pandemic, like, right? yeah. finally going out of the room. Yeah, we're used to being, like, isolated. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have my mochi now. My stomach is really hurting. Oh, no. I feel like the shopping experience was like really impacted by the coronavirus 
Why would like what? Like, like the whole yeah, we didn't go to many shops. Normally, we just go walk into a store, mm. have a look around, and then you have to do all away. these digital cues. Yeah, yeah. Like, guys, look. Still waiting for the Burberry one. We're still forty third, forty third on the line. And that, and you joined it as soon as we actually yeah. got to Bista Village. We joined at like hundred and eight, I think. Um, yeah. Anyway, guys, my so, yeah. time for to have my mochi. Hey guys, so we're home now. Um, True's just like prepping for the kimchi burger. And basically, I don't know if you've seen on TikTok, there's this like Mexican sweets. So it's like with chamoy. So it's like fizzy sweets like this. And then you dip it into this thing called chamoy, which is like a Mexican sauce thing. Um, and with also tagine. I think I that's it. So basically, I've been seeing this sweet all over TikTok. So what you do is you like, the chamoy is mixed with the fizzy sweets and then it's also got this seasoning over it. So I ordered this from the original chamoy that I found on TikTok. So these are the sweets. So you can pick out what sweets you want. Um, so I went for like some fizzy cherries, some tongue stuff, these, whatever. And then this is the chamoy. And then you also have the, um, the powder that you dip it in. So me and True are gonna eat this now because We've been excited. Well, actually, yesterday we tried another one that was already mixed. It arrived yesterday and we couldn't wait. So yesterday I had, I bought two things. So I bought the one that was like a pre-mix. So he, I'm assuming it's the guy that runs business. Um, the person has like already mixed the chamoy with the sweets and everything together. And they were like peach rings and they were really nice. But this is a like a platter so you can dip it in yourself. Um, and I'm excited to see what like other sweets taste like with this. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this now. What sweet should, I, should we go for first? Cause you need to try it as well, Drew. Do you want to try it as well? Yeah, you feed me, but my hands are chicken. Uh, no, one. it's more satisfying if you eat yourself. Yeah, no, you dip it nice. Okay, so I want the sweet. And then dip it into the chamoy. Dip. Okay, do like a nice dip. And then into the powder. I'm having it. No, can I have it first? Please, I'm cooking. Mm. Oh, is it too much? Mmm. I feel like it's it's nicer when you pre-mix it. So then it soaks all of the sauce. It's like a sour, sour, salty, isn't it? How would you pronounce, uh, like, um, explain what this tastes like? Sour. But it's also like, it's not spicy. But yeah, it's just sour. Mm. Oh my God. Homemade kimchi. Homemade kimchi. Been ripening for like a couple of days. Oh. Wait, do you want to hear the fizz? Oh! Oh, oh no. True said you want to hear the fizz and then look what happened. He just made a mess everywhere. It's alive.
you guys were finally done. Well, you're finally done because you made this all. Thanks, Drew. Korean fried chicken burger with like a kimchi slaw and then sweet potato fries coated in potato starch for the extra crispiness. Some truffle mayo. You wouldn't let me eat this in your car, it'd be too messy. Mm. Do you hear that crunch, guys? Look. Wait, let me go first. So today I have some crispy sweet potatoes. Shh. You're doing the most, you're doing the most. Can I just try, please? Guys, this is the aftermath of the cooking. Needs to clean all this. I'm doing it for the vlog, man. So what do you rate your food? A 10. It was very messy though, look at my hands. Mm. I'm not that hungry. More for me. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs>